नॉन यूनिफॉर्म सर्क्यूलर मोशन लेट मी रिकॉल यूनिफॉर्म सर्क्यूलर मोशन फर्स्ट वॉट डू यू रिमेंबर अबाउट यूनिफॉर्म सर्क्यूलर मोशन वॉट वॉज द वन लाइन नेसेसरी एंड सफिशियंट डेफिनेशन ऑफ यूनिफॉर्म सर्क्यूलर मोशन स्पीड रिमेन्स कॉन्स्टेंट यस देर आर मेनी अदर थिंग्स पीरियोडिसिटी एंड वॉट एवर दैट दैट्स फाइन वॉट इज द वन स्पॉट ऑन थिंग स्पीड रिमेन्स कॉन्स्टेंट सो वॉट इज दैट वन स्पॉट ऑन थिंग फॉर नॉन यूनिफॉर्म सर्क्यूलर मोशन speed is variable period the basic dna difference between uniform circular motion and non uniform circular motion is the speed is constant in ucm and speed is variable in nucm can you see v1 v2 v3 in ucm uniform circular motion it was v v v that's point number 1 is this point clear first of all everyone so what's the difference between ucm and nucm speed is constant in ucm speed is variable in nucm question number 2 in uniform circular motion i asked you is it accelerated motion or uniform motion the answer was it is an accelerated motion why because yes speed remains constant but the direction is changing constantly in other words is velocity changing or not the answer was yes immediately we said if velocity is changing only one quantity can be responsible for it acceleration there has to be an acceleration but but if only direction is changing that acceleration should be perpendicular to velocity right and perpendicular to velocity radially inwards that's why the term centripetal acceleration was coined so tell me one thing what is happening in non uniform circular motion even the magnitude is changing okay so direction is changing and magnitude is also changing how about listen very carefully how about i don't mix them i keep them separate means how about i keep the direction changing of velocity separate with the magnitude change tell me who is responsible for direction change still centripetal obviously centripetal where was it perpendicular to velocity radially inwards over here then centripetal can only change direction it cannot change magnitude so there must be one more acceleration component who is now responsible to change magnitude and that component is called tangential acceleration listen very carefully no need to get bothered about it very very simple there are two guys one is ac ac is short for centripetal acceleration ac changes direction only and in order to change only direction it must act perpendicular to velocity do you agree or not yes sir now magnitude is also changing okay other guy comes at at is tangential direction tell me if you want only want something to speed up or speed down where should that act and not Touch the direction. Changes magnitude only, and that is possible when a t is parallel to v. Beautiful, beautiful. Velocity change is divided into two parts: direction change, magnitude change. Who changes direction? A c. Who changes magnitude? at what is ac centripetal acceleration what is at tangential acceleration in ucm is ac there yes is at there no because magnitude is not changing in non uniform circular motion both are there in other words hey in other words ac centripetal is always there centripetal acceleration is always there whether it's ucm or non ucm at 
only props up in non-uniform circular motion. So what is the definition of tangential acceleration? The rate of change of speed, pretty simple. Nothing more, nothing less. D mod V by dt is at. 